Hello, today we're going to be doing a Terraria review, and this is me fighting a monster, because Terraria is fun, and I am definitely not the person who should be making a review of it, but apparently my friend thought I should be, so I guess I'm, that's what I'm doing. Clearly you can tell that I did not do well. I mean... They literally spawned a monster on me. It's not my fault. It's, not, it's their fault. Come on. Be better. There are three ways to get around in Terraria. You can walk like a normal person. And you can use your... You can use your weapon. You can fly. You can fly if you have wings as seen right here you can use your weapons I just didn't put it and you can if you have a mount ride your mount this is important because this allows much quicker ways to get around the map than just walk this is an explanation of a system that allowed that is mainly used actually almost entirely used in um multiplayer this allow its only purpose is multiplayer this allows you i don't even think it's in, in single player this allows you to have parties which tells you where your friends are and if you're doing a free for all they can't hurt you it's basically a teamy system some weapons are better than other weapons some weapons allow ranged attacks Combined with the normal attacks. This is basically just how weapons work. And it's not surprising at all. Which is kind of why it's some weapons are ne not necessary. Nighttime is the time where all the enemies come out. This allows... There are enemies out in the day, but if you have royal jelly, slimes won't be a problem. So those are pretty much the only people out. That is just all. The last mechanic is mining, which is a pretty self-explanatory mechanic, especially if you've ever played Minecraft, which I'm assuming is all of you, because there's going to be like four people watching this video. Not important. Anyway, this is just all. Mining is not that complicated. You start off copper, and apparently there's an achievement for it. Mining ores. Haha, <laughs> Terraria having a story. Why would you think that at all? There is no story. Like, there is no spoon. So, with all that in question, what do I think about Terraria? Well, I don't know. Because it's really, really fun. But I only probably got it because my friends were convincing me to. So... It's fun, but I probably wouldn't have got it on my own, and it wouldn't. And it was not the first game I wanted to get, but because my friends were nagging me, I have to get it. Although because I played it, I became good at it, and I like it. So I'm going to give it a four out of no wait no, an eight out of ten. Yeah, no, probably would be better to me if there was a slight bit of story, but I don't care. There is no story. Only sp the gameplay is good, but I don't love it enough to bring it up to a 10. That's the thing. So let's let the music play us out, and I will show you a cool boss fight that I did with my friends. 